Good day everybody. Let's now discuss how does lightning arrestor work. I'm sure that everybody must have seen a lightning. A lightning basically happens when two clouds, the rain carrying clouds, for example, this is a rain carrying cloud, this is the other one. Suppose these two clouds carry rain and these, one of these clouds make it negatively charged, which obviously induces positive charge on the other cloud. This happens because air in between the max is a dry electric medium, and these two clouds, different clouds, behaves as a two plates of a capacitor. This is a negative charge, and this is positively charged. So when the charge gets accumulated, in to such an extent say 10,000 10,000 volts per centimeter then the air in between gets ionized thus these both clouds gets discharged forming a lightning arc which may run even for kilometers now there are also possibilities where a rain bearing cloud this is the earth surface where the top part usually gets positively charged and the bottom part usually gets negatively charged and earth being obviously this acts as a one plate of a capacitor this is the other plate of the capacitor so this gets positively charged and the voltage between the two plates is sufficiently high say 10,000 or 25,000 volts per centimeter then the discharge happens, the lightning occurs and this lightning obviously hits the tall parts of the earth, say tall as the building or the tallest tree, whatever it may be. In order to avoid this, on the principle of action of points, we have on top of a tall building a sharp rod, which is sharp at the end and it has a copper wire or copper conductor connected and properly earthed. When lightning occurs, this directly comes and hits the rod and we always know that the current passes through the least resistant path and copper being a very good conductor of electricity has the least resistance. Thus, the current passes through the copper rod and then it's properly earthed. The earth gets without the lightning, the current path doesn't pass through the building structure and it passes, takes the least short way and it gets to some earth. This is how the lightning arrestor works.